guys, it's The Gaming Mermaid, and welcome to a brand new series. This is going to be The Sims 4 Disney Villain Series. So, as you guys can see, I have created and added a bunch of new Disney villains, starting with Cruella de Vil here. So, I did have a series with her, but this is going to be a completely different save file. Now, as you can see, all of these Disney villains are actually teenagers. So this is gonna be like before the Descendants in case you guys are wondering. So that is why the Descendants aren't in there. And for the adult in here, I decided to add Lady Tremaine as an elder. So I actually got this off of the gallery. So I literally just looked up Lady Tremaine in case you guys were wondering. So spelled it like that. And this is the one that I decided to download. This is by Bexen. <laughs> I think so if you guys were wondering and I also decided to get Jafar um, because the Jafar I made I was not too happy with so I decided to download this one over here this is by Arthur over here you guys can see how it's spelled I thought it looked really cool and I made him into a teenager now I was also looking at here and this person decided to make Jafar with Iago as a cat how cute would that be do you guys think I should add Iago or any other companions as a cat I was kind of thinking of making Scar from The Lion King, so let me know what you guys think about that. But for now, who I have right now is Cruella de Vil, I have the Evil Queen, I have Maleficent, I have Ursula, um, I, oh, I also added Captain Hook, let me go ahead and show you guys how I did that. So once again, I literally just searched up Captain Hook over here, and let's see, I think it's this one right here, or this one, oh my gosh. <gasps> Oh, it's this one. It's by Jackie Simley. So that is the Captain Hook I decided to go with. Alrighty. And then I also got Lady Tremaine, as I said, and Jafar. So that is what I have so far. Now what I'm thinking is I kind of want them to create all kinds of craziness. So I might go ahead and change them all into vampires. Let me know what you guys think about that. But I think that's what I'm going to do. So let's go ahead and get this started. So if I am going to create them into vampires or whatever, I'm thinking where we should move is Forgotten Hollow because that's where all the vampires live and they could create some chaos. So let's go over here to Forgotten Hollow and I think these are okay. It says I can't afford this. I think we are going to go ahead and we have no choice but to live here or we could move here and then we could build our own house but I don't know how to build so that's a problem but um, we're going to have more of a problem with like seven people in this house. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna move here for right now and we'll create our own house for it. Alrighty, here we go. So the first thing that we wanna do is try to get to know our neighbors because our neighbors are all vampires. <laughs> so we could try and ask them to turn us into vampires as well. So that would be pretty cool. Let's go ahead and check on everybody. Look how cute everyone is. Not for long because they're gonna be super evil. Another idea I had was once we have our house up and running, I think Lady Tremaine over here is going to actually adopt a child and that child will be Cinderella who will be stuck in the house. She will be locked in the house and she will be the one to clean everything. So let's go into build mode over here. I'm thinking what we need to do is look up a house. I, I, I'm so bad at building like it's not even funny. So I think we're gonna go with this house over here. It looks pretty awesome. It looks very nice like a nice little mansion. So this actually has two Two basements so like the lowest basement has like a vampire room and then we have like a mini apartment down here in this basement then this is the first floor and then the second floor I think this is gonna be pretty cool so we have insufficient funds so you know what we're gonna do we're gonna add some cheats up in here oh my gosh here it is you guys it looks gorgeous I love the ivy on the outside we have a little pool over here oh that looks awesome and there's an area for a pet how cute is that? You could even give it a bath outside. Oh my goodness, this looks gorgeous. Let's check out the first floor here. So this is actually the upper floor. <gasps> Wow, okay, so we have this huge like office area. That's really cool. We have a nice sized bedroom here. That is really awesome. I love how spacious this is. <gasps> this is like a little nursery. Oh my gosh, you could put like, I think those are cribs. I'm not sure actually. I don't know. I think it's laundry. <gasps> how cool is that? Oh my gosh, look at the size of this room. It's like a mini apartment in here. Oh my goodness. So we have this huge room over here. <gasps> Look how lovely this bathroom is. Oh, and it has like a spa area. Oh, how nice is that? Awesome, awesome. All right, that's the upper floor. So we have two bedrooms, 
up there. <gasps> Look at this. We have like a cool little bar area. Then we have another living room area. It looks really nice. Very nice indeed. And then we have this open foyer area, I guess. Um, the kitchen. Very cute. And the dining room. Wow. This is very spacious, I must say. Let's go ahead and go to the basement. So this is the first basement here. We have another office here, which is pretty cool. Huh. Interesting. It's like a police force or whatever. It's probably where they like conduct their evil plans. <laughs> Anyways, we have a woodworking table. And then we have another little bedroom here as well it's like its own little apartment it has this bathroom very cool and i believe that there's another basement let's check it out so here is the second basement and this is basically like a vampire area is this a is this an elevator oh no i think it's a closet oh my gosh it looks really nice but they whoever made this did an amazing job it looks very lovely and a very great use of space i must say they really used all the space very well very efficiently look we have little frogs on the outside oh my goodness you guys so here is their new house it looks amazing so First things first, they all need to go ahead and do their homework. That is the first thing we're going to do. <laughs> and what, Actually, you know what? They're villains. They're villains. They're not going to do their homework. Are you crazy? Absolutely not. We're not doing homework. No way. No way. But what I am going to do is I'm going to have Lady Tremaine over here. We're going to go and see. I actually didn't see if we have any computers. <gasps> oh, no. We have to go ahead and check if we have any computers around here because we're going to need them because we want to adopt a child. We're going to adopt Cinderella over here. Here is a computer. Okay, Lady Tremaine, I know you're a little you're a little old lady, but <laughs> we need to get you up here so that we can go ahead and where would that be? Would that be under web? I'm not sure. Household, volunteer activities, move household, adopt. Yes, that's what we want to do. We want to adopt cinderella uh javar javar i don't need you over here are you trolling the forums he's playing blick block you're being too nice nope get out of here okay lady tremaine let's do this okay javar get off <laughs> thank you <laughs> okay <gasps> oh my gosh how cute is she okay we have to adopt a cinderella who should we adopt who should we adopt i think the one that looks closest like cinderella is this girl and we can make her like a blonde haired girl <gasps> Oh my gosh, wait, I didn't mean to adopt her. I just wanted to like look at her. Uh, oh my gosh, okay, I, I think we adopted her. I, I think that's that's a thing that is happening. Oh my goodness, where is she? All right, here we go. Where, is she leaving? She's leaving. Uh oh, uh, um, um, okay. Well, that was unexpected. So basically what we're gonna have to go ahead and do is lock this door so that Cinderella cannot get out. Oh my gosh, who is singing? I'm hearing somebody singing. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Captain Hook is singing over here, having the time of his life. Oh my gosh, she is almost done. Look at her. Okay, girl, here she is. <gasps> the orphanage was like to introduce we're gonna make her Cinderella. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Now, Lady Tremaine is officially the stepmother of Cinderella. Oh, um, hello, sir. Uh, he hello, sir. Uh, let's do a friendly introduction, I guess. <gasps> Look how cute she is. Oh my goodness, she is adorable. Absolutely adorable. We need everybody to get to know him because he is actually a vampire. So, he will be our way. Let's invite him inside. And we're going to do a greet new neighbor. We need to get to know this guy because he's going to be our way, our ticket to becoming vampires so that we can cause all kinds of craziness over here. Okay, here we go, you guys. Ask to turn. This is the moment we've been waiting for. So Maleficent has been talking it up with this guy. He was like talking about, oh, I should probably go. Uh, no. Uh, 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 no. You have to turn us into vampires. That's what you need to do. Oh, no. Don't leave. No. Oh, my gosh. Oh my goodness, he turned into its dark form. <gasps> Maleficent is gonna get turned. Oh my gosh. <gasps> there it is, you guys. Oh my gosh. Is she gonna turn? Let's see. <gasps> oh, oh. oh my gosh, Cruella. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yep, she is getting turned. He is looking really, really angry right now. Oh my goodness, Cruella, do not mock his outfit. We need him. <laughs> we need him. He needs to turn us all into vampires. He needs to get to know everybody around here. Oh my gosh, little Cinderella is over here. 
talking about so Maleficent. Oh my gosh, you guys. What? School is stupid. Are you serious? School teaches important things. Oh my goodness, Captain Hook. But that's too bad. He's probably not going to go to school anyway. Okay, here it is, you guys. The next one is going to be Cruella asking him to turn. Let's do this. Look at her. She's like asking him, come on, please. Please, I want to be evil too. Oh my gosh, here he goes. He is ready for it. He is ready. She's going to troll the forums after this. Okay, next up, two down. We have like five to go, seriously. One, two, three, four. We have four more. I don't think I'm going to turn Lady Tremaine into a vampire. She'll just be evil. <laughs> Ooh, greetings, child. My ancient plasma senses, you have recently been turned. It will take a few days to fully change into a vampire, but fear not, the night awaits. <gasps> Got it, becoming a vampire. It takes a few days already so far so good i'm still trying to schmooze this guy over for evil queen to become a vampire he's been rejecting her <laughs> so this is a little challenging Alrighty, guys so i decided to give cinderella a little bit of a makeover so this is what i decided to go with for her every day where i really think this dress is super cute and i kind of like the colors because it looks like it's kind of like dusty i guess um so you know she's gonna be inside the house cleaning all day and stuff like that so that is what i decided to go for it for her every day her formal wear looks very lovely so if she does end up meeting prince charming you know she looks very very lovely indeed so here is her athletic wear i decided to go again for something very muted and like torn up and stuff um for her sleep wear this is what i decided to go with i'm not sure how i feel about it i might change that actually this is her party wear i thought it was really cute and here is her so web wear so that is what we have for cinderella so far so let's go back in the game so here she is in the game she is such a good little girl that she actually did her homework on her own free will like I didn't even tell her to do that and she already did that on her own free will so that is what she decided to do but I locked the door so basically a locked door for household and I locked it for Cinderella it's not even an option because I already locked it for her so yes that was what I decided to do but um I don't know how I feel about it honestly because do you think that she should go to school or should she be forced to stay in here? The problem that I'm afraid of is that if she doesn't go to school and she fails her classes, then she'll be taken away, which um, I don't want to happen. I want her to stay in the game, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Maybe when she becomes a teenager, she'll run away. Um, so that could be an option as well, but I don't want her to get taken away as a child because if she fails, that could definitely happen so let me know what you guys think should she go to school or not let me know in the comments down below that vampire guy he decided to leave so maleficent and cruella are going to turn into vampires but then when i tried to do the same thing with the evil queen he totally rejected her every time so i don't know if it was because he's tired or he was just like hey you're just using me for my like um vampireness but i don't know i need to i need to try to have them become vampires so we need the evil queen jafar Captain Hook and Ursula to turn into vampires. So I think what we're going to go ahead and do once she is done eating, we're going to travel to their household because he has a sister. So, I mean, we could try and ask her to turn us into vampires because obviously that guy is sick and tired of us already. Okay, here we go. So hopefully they're not sleeping. I would imagine not, but let's knock on the door and see what happens. Come on now. Come on, evil queen. We can do it. Oh, yes. Here she is. So here is his sister. She is also a vampire, obviously. So we're going to go ahead and get to know her and hopefully she will help us turn into vampires because that's what I want. Oh, you know what? How interesting would it be if Captain Hook tried to be romantic with her? I think they could vibe very well. You know, I, I think they could vibe very well. Hmm. Let's try to get to know her a little bit. Let me know what you guys think. I made, well, actually, this Captain Hook was uh, made to be romantic. So it could definitely be an option if he's like a heartbreaker and he tries to like flirt with all the girls. Wow, he could already kiss her hands. Um, let's not do that because we don't want her to reject us instantly. You know, we want to get to know her a little bit. <gasps> I think she said yes. Oh, yes, she did. Oh, so a nap. So Captain Hook is next. Look, she is ready for him. She is ready to turn him. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Yeah, she looks like she means business. She's not playing around. <laughs> okay, so we need three more. Three more victims. All right, she did that like so quickly too. So that is fantastic. That is fantastic. Okay, wow. Alrighty, yup. Captain Hook is ready to go. Now let's try this with Ursula. All right, yes, finally. <laughs> that took like forever. Seriously, look at him. He's so romantic. I think Captain Hook wants to 
flirt with this vampire for sure. That might be a possibility. Look at him. He's like terrified. <laughs> oh yeah, he's feeling it. He is feeling it. I think last but not least is Evil Queen. She's been continuously rejected by the vampire. Seriously, it's been taking me forever. But hopefully this vampire will let us have Evil Queen turn into a vampire. That would be fantastic. All right. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> so... Let's see. Are you feeling it? Oh, she is feeling it. Okay, so next up, we have the evil queen. Oh, wow. That was fast. She is, like, seriously so ready. She is so ready for it. Okay, here we go. Yes. Finally, now she's feeling it. Okay, I think I got everybody. <gasps> did I get Jafar? <gasps> I don't think I did. Oh my gosh, no, I didn't. Okay, Jafar is the last one. Okay, I've been literally at this all night, and she still won't turn Jafar into a vampire. It's like ridiculous and I think they're all going to school right now so I don't know I, I really okay I'm gonna make Jafar skip school absolutely not he needs to go ahead and turn look I'm gonna ask him to turn into a vampire <gasps> maybe we should ask him as well okay hold on I didn't even realize he was home this whole time my goodness okay look at this so he's like asking her right he's asking her about turning and she's like oh yeah cool and then she doesn't do anything like seriously seriously all right let's let's move on to this guy Hey, how's it going? Hi. You have a lovely house. Can you turn me into a vampire, please? I would really appreciate that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Finally. Oh my goodness. I've literally been at this forever. He is finally going to turn into a vampire. He is skipping school for this. <laughs> but hey, it's going to be all worth it because then he'll be able to cause all kinds of chaos. Oh my gosh. Look at the size of that spot. No, 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 no thanks. Um, no thanks. Okay. Are you good? Let's get this over with. Let's get this on. Yes. Okay. You know what? Can you still go to school? I'm very curious. I'm not sure if he can or not, but uh, I guess we are. He is very, very look at him. <laughs> um, okay. Well, apparently he is not feeling too well, but it's all good because he's going to still go to school. I think he is very late, but that's besides the point. So he's going to go to school and I'm going to go back into the household with Lady Tremaine and Cinderella. Let me know what you guys think and what you guys would like to see in the future for the series. Do you want me to make Disney princesses in this series as well? Let me know what you guys think about that and any other suggestions in the comments down below. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a like. And if you're new, subscribe to become a mermaid or a merman. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.